Hey, what's going on guys? Ryan here at DetailKing.com and today we're going to be teaching you how to remove oxidation from any wave runner, jet ski, boat, or marine surface. So today we're going to be working on this 1999 Kawasaki 1100 wave runner. As for the products we'll be using, we'll be using our Diamond Cut Ultra Compound, our Blue Diamond Polish, and our STS 3000 Polymer Sealant. We'll be teaming these products up with the Flex PE8 Rotary Polisher, with a 3-inch backing plate, with some 3-inch buffing pads, also a 1-inch backing plate with 1-inch buffing pads, some polishing microfiber towels, and a set of gloves. First, we will start off by using the 1 inch backing plate with our 1 inch orange Lake Country compounding pad. We'll be using this with our Diamond Cut Ultra compound. Diamond Cut Ultra is a micro diminishing compound making it perfect to use to remove oxidation with our rotary polisher. The Flex PE8 has multiple options for your backing plate making it the ideal polisher to use when doing things such as this wave runner. We are first using the one inch pad to get all the hard to reach areas and rounded edges. Then we will go back using our three inch backing plate with our three inch buffing pad and finish the rest. For the next step in our process, we will be polishing the newly corrected paint. To do this, we'll be using blue diamond polish along with our 3 inch backing pad and our 3 inch polishing pad. We'll use a cross hatch pattern just like we did with our compounding, however now we will use it on speed setting 2 instead of speed setting 5. Polishing the paint helps bring out that extra shine and leaves a high gloss finish. Okay guys, for the final step in the process, we're now going to protect the paint. We're going to use our black finishing pad along with our STS 3000 polymer sealant.
Okay guys, now that this Wave Runner is looking good, make sure you visit us right here at DetailKing.com where we have everything you need to get your car clean or Wave Runner like a Detail King. See you guys next time.